What is up, guys, and welcome back. Tonight, I, like I said, I have a very special thing for you guys. I am doing a review of a new independent film that just released today. It is out today. It is called Plan B. This movie was directed by Brandon Tambury. It is starring Jamie Lee and John Heater. So, I first I want to give a shout out to the folks at Joke Zero Comedy and the Plan B Press. I, like I said before in a previous video, they reached out to me to review this film. I think it's really cool. It's an honor for me to be able to do this. So, thank you guys for that. Really appreciate it. Um, and with that being said, let's dive into this. Uh, it, this is a short film. I like it though. It's an, like an hour and a half comedy. I like when comedies are shorter versus really longer. Because sometimes you try and spin in too many jokes and they don't all hit. So I really did appreciate like it's a nice tight like about hour 30, hour 32. Um, and basically th this film, I thoroughly enjoyed this film. Uh, this is the story of Piper who is basically her life. She's kind of like going out drinking and stuff uh, and ends up sleeping with her neighbor Evan after a drunk night. Finds out she's pregnant and then go ahead and pretends that she's going to have a baby with someone else. Says she wants to have a baby with someone else because she doesn't want Evan to be the father. Unbeknownst to Evan, he doesn't even know that he's the father. And it's just – and then, of course, we, she goes out on a couple of dates with these random guys. And, of course, there's guy Cameron who she's met in the coffee shop. She's blown him off a few times. She's like, I don't like you. You're gross. And she's like, hey, he's rich, he's successful. And so she does this whole charade where she meets the parents and everything. And like they're like months and months in, and we find out, you know, that basically like she has like the surprise party at the end, and it's just the whole thing gets blows up in her face. And we find out throughout the movie that Evan is actually a really great guy. He's very dorky, very awkward. Um, and John Heater did a great job playing this character. Like when he's picking yeah. apart the food and stuff, it's just great. And Jamie Lee was awesome. And the actress that played Mai, the best friend of uh, Piper, was amazing. You also had Kate Flannery in this from The Office. So I was really happy to see her because I'm a big fan of The Office. You have Shane Elizabeth, as you guys also know from American Pie and other films. Um, so you know, the overall, it's a great cast. It's a funny film. I thoroughly enjoyed it. I just honestly just finished it for the third time. So if you guys are looking for a good date night film, this is right up your alley. Uh, it's a little bit of a dark humor, which I did appreciate. Uh, there's always room for dark humor. It was done right. And of course, the whole moral of the story is like, just don't lie when something like this happens. Because basically, like, she has sex with John Heater, like I said. They use an old condom and she gets pregnant and just the whole thing just spirals out of control for Piper's character so quickly. And just the journey she goes on as she gets more and more pregnant, she gets a little more and more like, I guess like emotional and, and stuff like that. And on in the Lamaz class, the fact that we got Vernon Davis of I think he was a, he played in the NFL for like I think 12 or 13 years. He's like a three-time pro bowler. This guy was like the 6th overall pick in the NFL draft in like 2006. Is in this movie as a Lamaze instructor. I was not expecting that. I loved that. I thought it was a hilarious choice. So kudos to you guys. That was a great choice. Hilarious. Not expecting that. So, with that being said, I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do a rating system here. So on a scale of one to ten, I'm gonna give this like a seven point nine out of ten. I again, I really enjoyed it. It's a good, solid flick, and honestly, it's not like there's really not a whole lot of bad language or anything too sexual or anything violent in this film. I think it's safe for I would say probably 14, 14, 15 up, maybe depending on on your parenting styles. You know, I'm not one to judge, whatever. So. Again, definitely go check this film, my guys. It's solid. It's available on so many of the streaming services right now. It's available on Apple TV, Microsoft, Google Play, Vandango at Home, aka VUDU Digital. This is a great film. I would dove into more details, but I don't want to give away too much. So I want you guys to go check out this film. Again, it's it's available tonight. It came out today. So if you're seeing this on 
on Friday, September 27, 2024. The film is out right now. Go check it out. I'll be tagging Joe Coke Zero, uh, Joke Zero Comedy, sorry, Joke Zero Comedy in my video below. So go ahead and check them out. They're on Instagram. I want to give a shout out to them again. Thank you so much for this opportunity. And also to anyone else, you know, if anybody has any independent films, you know, big or small budget, and you want something to review them, check them out. Please, you know, get a hold of me on here on YouTube. I'm also on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter. You know, just reach out to me like like these guys did. You know, it was an awesome honor, and I really appreciate you guys. And I'll talk to you all next time. Peace.